Hey everybody, this is Joby and today I want to show you how to get this hat. It's a lead in high aisle. Let's take a look at it right now. And I'm on my wood elf because he's uh, very barbaric looking and uh, rather short. So that's always good. Hats. Go down. It's the night. Something. I'll tell you as soon as I get there. It's this one. Night Hunter's Cowl. It's a lead in antiquity that's found in high aisle. Well, actually, Aminosa Isle. So, as you can see, it looks very cool. It's like a um, hawk or something, I guess. Night Hunter, Lord of the Hunt, Guide Me. And then uh, it says a prayer to Hercene, but, you know, Hercene is God of the Hunt. So, to me, it looks like some type of either an owl or a hawk. I'm not really sure. You can just, uh, you could make a costume that looked really similar to the Watchmen, you know, the owl. and That would be kind of cool totally against the lore what are you gonna do so I like it I think uh, it's definitely worth it it's super easy to pick up you can see here you can uh, you can dye it if you want to I will not I'll just leave it just like this I guess you could make it gold Pre pretty interesting uh, something is uh, pretty good like I said I like it so what I'm gonna do now actually is I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get on my man PV deeps and because if we go to my map and we look here uh i don't have any way shrines there i only have one which is the starting way shrine peewee has everything all the way shrines and uh spent about four hours in there and last night and it was a good time i really like it i'm loving high isle i think it's a it's a great expansion people that are saying it's boring and stuff um i don't know what they're playing but uh i disagree all right so let's go ahead and uh Hand over to Pee Wee Deeps in uh, High Isle, and I'll show you exactly where to get this. Okay, so I'm at the Serpent's Hollow Way Shrine, and where that is is on uh, Aminos Island over here. As you can see, I've got all the Way Shrines, and uh, I'm only missing like two world bosses, and uh, been playing a lot. Got all the sets from here. Having a great time, by the way. I think this is an excellent uh, expansion and uh that's just my opinion but i think it's there's going to be so much stuff to do so from banished refuge uh striking locale you just go northeast and you head right there where the road goes and that's where the lead will be is just right up the hill and i'll show you let's just go there right now i'm gonna ride there just head off this way if you don't have any of this stuff you don't have the striking locale you know you can just look on the map that i just showed you and you'll be able to find it. Uh, maybe I should also tell you to get to Eminos Island. If you don't know, you need to get to this way shrine. Probably you'll start here, ride up this road, get this way shrine, and then come up here to Dufert Shipyard's way shrine. Then you go here and you can see boat to Eminos Station. Come here, do whatever you want, any of the way shrines. You just need to get to Serpent's Hollow and then over here to the striking locale, Banish Refuge is just in this little kind of ending point and then we're going to be riding right up here all right doing a lot of videos about a lot of different things there's so much to do in this patch uh it's pretty crazy uh, something i learned that was very interesting is that xbox series uh machines the update is only 6.7 uh gigabytes whereas with the old xbox one it's going to be 37 gigabytes so that's a reason to buy a new xbox right there just get lower patches because mine was finished so quick and like an hour and i was uh very happy about that but i was definitely confused and i was worried like it was going to be a problem and then when i turned it on uh, at my time 5 p.m the afternoon it was just good to go and i deleted my save data and restarted the xbox came right in first it was real laggy it was weird and then just got warmed up I guess I don't know start everything loaded in and it's uh, fantastic so what you're gonna do is you see the waterfall right here it is this little road just like I said and then what we're gonna do is if you're facing the waterfall you just go right go this way and you're gonna come up by these funky plants and then it's just right here let's kill this guy first because he's annoying that's it like that and uh, it'll either be somewhere in this little patches of grass over here. Um, 
if it's best to come alone, don't come with your guild mates or with other people because there is a cooldown. We had uh, one of our guildies pick it up and then the other ones couldn't find it. Won't be up here though. It's just right when you come around the corner like this and then it's pretty much straight here. It's called Druidic Arrows. And then you just press A, you get the lead, and then you go pick it up. And uh, it's all good. Just right here on the map. So just remember, just go from this area, this little waterfall, take a right, go around the corner. The first actual um, landmark is going to be this bush. You know, from the waterfall this way, and you'll see the bush. Just go up this way, and then you'll find it. I think it's really worth it. looks great on my wood elf. I won't wear it on this guy, but uh, I will wear it on him. Probably. Maybe. Who knows? All right. So please give me a like and a subscribe if you enjoyed the content. Leave a comment in the comment section. Uh, tell me what do you think about High Isle. Have you tried High Isle? Have you been coming out? Lots of leads, lots of mythics, lots of antiquities. It's insane. The only problem is like trying to figure out what to do. And uh, we've been having a great time. I didn't probably going to do Dread Cell Reef tomorrow, the trial. But uh, today it was just running around getting way shrines, having a good time, and uh, definitely having a good time. Join me in Discord, the most chill Discord server on the planet. There's a link in the description. And if you're not doing anything, 8.15 p.m. Eastern Time, follow me on Twitch. Upper Echelon Mediocrity is the name of the channel. And uh, just one word. If you're on Xbox North American server, you can join my guild. My guild's name is Upper Echelon Mediocrity. And right now we have 487 total members, 57 people online, no members pending, and uh, lots of helpful, friendly people. Everybody's in high all right now, going crazy, having a good time, uh, just like a new patch always is, new expansion, and uh, we're doing it. We're not in the guild finder, so you need to send me a message on Xbox. My name is Coyote, C-H-A-O-T-Y, and I'll get you in as soon as time permits and whatnot. All right, so until that time, let's get paid.